and good morning people welcome back to Alondra last time we were making our way through the mines and we haven't found anyone alive yet which is a bit of a problem because the deeper we go the less likely it is we've got to find one so yeah well here's hoping so let's go There's nothing left to do upstairs, so what we need to do is down here. Now, we have a little puzzle room. Nothing amazing. Oh, money. These uh, trolleys, we can actually move. They don't do much, but they, you can move them. And we've got a uh, minecart here. Which, um, doesn't really take us anywhere. So, we need to find out where we need to go. Oh, it's in the process of being expanded westwards, so we need to go west. Hmm, I. I don't think we can through there, but there is a switch there, so we need to get that. If I can get it correct. And there we go. Now we've got a box there. So, how to get onto that? Well, we need to move these rocks. Pretty simple. Get on top, push one onto another. Move that down there. And. Uh, yeah. These two chests just have herbs in. Which I don't really need, so. I will show that they have herbs. So, yeah, I can't really do, uh, do anything with those. Okay, now I can go this way. And we've got some more rock, rock turtles. Easy to deal with. Oh, oh there's someone over there. However, doesn't look good, does it? I need a better way to move around the water. Not that I can get to him this way anyway. Hmm. How's to do so? Well, these uh, poles are here for a reason. And it's same. So, all of the miners are dead. That's not a good thing. Our uh, successful rescue mission has not been successful at all. I was hoping to get both there. So, back we go, and I almost hit that spike. Actually, I'm going to go and do that deliberately. 
Thank you. Because I want to show you what this here is. You probably saw it at the beginning of the part. This is a rest stop. You go in. And it's a safe area. There are two uh, triangles on the floor. The right one restores all magic power. Not that I have any at the moment. And the left one restores all physical health. So that's a nice. And there's a safe hey, book in the middle. Which I'll do. Saving the tail. And it's inside. Excellent. So, what do we do with this key? Well, we've only got one thing left that we can really do, which is uh, use this minecart. And we've got a uh, gate over here. So, what does this one say? Switch points. Left, no, left. So you go to the left west shaft, and right you have a U-turn. We, we went the right way, so let's take the left. And down we go. I see that as a pointless room because I show it. Oh well. Here we are, the west shaft. Or somewhere that we're not going that way. But we've got some boxes here, so let's get rid of some of these. Now we've got to step up. And there we go. <laughs> Tried to get away from that and a silver walked into it. Uh, I don't believe we can uh, walk in uh, walk over those, but uh usually make that first time. But another gilded falcon, that should be four. Five, sorry. So still on track. I don't think there's anything else down here. So up here we go. Into this room. Which doesn't really hold a heck of a lot. I believe this one's a herb. Nothing else in here, so let's take the minecart. Down and around. And we've made it to this point. Here it is. Push the lower, le uh, uh, lower lever three times and the upper lever once to start the lift. If it doesn't fit, uh, work, shake things up a bit. The engine's quite old. This actually is uh, quite good. So, lower lever three times and the upper lever once. Now, the engine's not working, so we need to shake things up a bit. 
So the way we do that is we jump on it. And it works! And we can go down the, down the lift now. We can only work on these four square things. We can't move from the other, other ones for some reason, but oh well. And yeah, this is a refresh shop, but refreshes all your he uh, health. Because what we have coming up is a little scene. That's a big monkey. Zazan. A crest. What's a crest? Oh, looks like they're working for Melsus. And he's looking for crests, so... Okay, so they've got two crests and there's seven to find. Something tells me we're going to have to go and sort that. He the source of the uh, cave-ins. If he's been bashing his way through rock, that's possible. Okay. Um. Hello, Mug. I think it's time to uh, beat you up. That's two down. And if you stay there, that, that's easy for me. Oh, money. Done. <laughs> Merg aren't really too dangerous and... For a final sort of boss of the area. Hmm. But what's this? Our second life vessel. So we now have 12 maximum health, which is nice. And I do believe there's nothing else we can do since the way is blocked there. We can only follow the way Zazan went. And now we can't even get back in there at all. So, if you miss anything in there, you will not be able to get it again, ever. So keep that in mind. We've got a few rocks in the way here. So I guess we can only go this way. No controls, just watching them go by. And up here. Again, no control until the Merc have gone. And then, automated to go up to the, uh, this part because they want us to have a look around. This is the tree they were talking about. The biggest tree in the land. By quite a margin, it seems. Lots of merg, lots of holes for rooms. And. Strangely enough, it doesn't show you any of the important bits. Which is good, because we will eventually be coming here. And down we go. And there is a room here, but I don't believe it holds anything for us. Rusted shirt. Does that help? 
No. So, yeah. Uh, switch in the middle of nowhere. Hmm. Anyways, don't need to worry about there for a moment. We wouldn't have a chance against Zerzan anyway. We've got way too little power. And as you can see, yeah, the balls, the balls are still here, but the ones below aren't. Oh, have you? They are indeed. Yeah, it was behind us. And yeah, Jess is just worried about us. Yeah. And Clyde's just worried about the village. So basically we have saved a total of one person so far, being Wendell. That's not a good sign. And we've got a lone rock here for some reason. Oh well. <laughs> And yeah. Mm. Take out some bushes, see if I can get any more money because I'm going to need it still. I'm going to be taking the long way round because I would like to pick up a few things. Uh, Merg books, beware of falling simians. Hmm. Oh, money. So, where to go, where to go? I do believe that there are a few things I could still do. Uh, one of them being going round and finding out some... Uh, Uh, okay, I'm uh, finding some of these smaller uh, oh, smaller gilded falcons. That's what I meant to say. I can't really do too much going this way. It seems. All right. So, bye, it is. And. We've got a statue there. Hmm. Don't think I can reach that yet. And a chest in the corner. Lots of things that I can't actually reach just yet. We've got a stone there that I can't move. And a chest there that I can't get to. A lot of teasing on, uh, when you first begin the game, because there's a lot of things around that you can't actually get. Just kill this one normally. I don't think there's anything this way either. Just make sure that. Uh, that big rock there. And nothing that way. Okay. Down here is the beach. And a house. Got an interesting chest there. And okay, I'm going, going, going. I believe there is one or two gilded falcons I can get while I'm going around this way. I just need to remember where, I, where they were.
There's a beat. There's another house which is closed off. A lot of the enemies you can just avoid like I'm doing right now, so... Yay for movements! Ah ha, I believe it's this way. There it is! The Sixth Gilded Falcon. There's a swamp down here. I do not want to be going in there because of a certain enemy that I cannot beat. Well, I could, but it's very dangerous. Uh... Oh, nice chest, chest there. Just an herb. I do believe that's it. Can't reach up to that one yet. And yes, now it's back to the village. Every penny counts. Okay. Scourge from hell themselves. Oh, okay then. Hey, I do seem a bit uh, annoying. Okay, so everyone's scattered around at the moment. Pepsimus is probably studying up. There's Giles. She's looking in on Bonaire. If you want to know what they're, they're talking about, you can find out yourself by playing the game and talking as normal. But my only thing to do is to come in here, pick up this, and throw it on the counter. 500 Gilda? Yes, please! And that's 13 hearts, so yay! I'm not sure if she has anything to replace that, so let's have a look. Nothing yet. That's fair enough. There's still that armour. Hmm. No, you're still not wanting to give it to me, I'm guessing. So. Indeed, you can actually uh, step on, uh, go on people's heads, so. There we go. Since this is my usual customary spot in the village, and he's taking it. So, until next time, well, have a wonderful day, have lots of fun, and we'll see why I can't get into Jess's house. Goodbye!